Welcome to the Triumph Fundamentals Weekly Insight Podcast. Each week, we'll sit down with President and CEO of Triumph, Jim Horn, as he shares experiences, insight, and stories that drive home the importance of the 31 fundamentals that make Triumph the best in class employee owned company it is today. Listen as Jim shares some important tips and information on what it takes to work smart. Many organizations today are faced with extremely heavy workloads without the necessary resources to effectively complete their work. This forces them to work long days and weeks in order to meet commitments they made to their customers. We've all heard the saying, work smarter and not harder. This has never been truer than in the environment we are faced with today. Given the limited number of resources, it would behoove us to place the maximum amount of effort towards working smarter. How can we work smarter? Most people work better when they have a clear vision in mind and understand what is expected of them. Therefore, it's extremely important that we prepare a plan that will allow us to work toward achieving our vision. Then we need to break the plan down into daily, weekly goals. Once this is done, we can begin by taking a few minutes at the end of each day to make sure we list the most urgent and important things that need to be accomplished the next day to move the needle towards meeting our weekly goals. Determine what information, materials, equipment, and other resources are needed to achieve tomorrow's activities, and then determine how you will get them accomplished. A key part of our daily planning will be to differentiate between activities that are urgent and those that are important. Urgent activities have a much shorter deadline and need to be completed that week or even that day. Get organized, rally your team, and make sure that they understand your daily expectations. Effectively communicate what needs to be accomplished and make sure they have everything they need to be successful. Make daily, weekly, and monthly planning a priority. If you are planning to work, you can't work the plan. Make sure your plan prioritizes what must be done first by paying close attention to the project milestones. Also look for better ways to get things done, learn from others, and commit to being a lifelong learner. The ability to delegate is another essential skill that a leader must possess. We all need to understand that the ability to delegate will make us more productive. Trust your teammates and don't get caught up in the minutia. Your time may be better spent more effectively on the bigger picture. Make every minute of your day count and don't spend an inordinate amount of time on tasks that will not get you closer to achieving the goals. Lesson learned. The key to increasing productivity is by working smarter and not harder. The better everyone on your team understands what needs to be accomplished, when it needs to be done, and what their individual role is, the better chance you have of achieving your goals. It's much easier to get to where you want to be once you know how you're going to get there.